I'm appalled that he would make a statement like that about Baltimore City. Baltimore City Councilman Robert Stokes is calling out Baltimore County Councilman Todd Crandall. This after Crandall blamed city residents for a disturbance at a carnival Sunday evening in the parking lot of East Point Mall that led to the arrest of 26 teens. Mall officials shut down the carnival because of an excess of people. It was the fights that broke yeah, down in the inside and the outside. Crandall wrote this on his Facebook page, quote, our community is under siege by people who do not live or work here and have no idea how to act in a civil society. He goes on to write, quote, all of the work being done to strengthen and improve our community is being undermined by city residents who somehow think it's okay to run wild, intimidate drivers at intersections, and come to our community to do nothing more than commit crime or cause chaos. Due to state law, police cannot release any information on the teens, so there is no way to accurately say where the teens resided. Marquise Dent is a city resident who works with youth in after school programs. To put a stigmatism on they're all bad or they're all this, they're all that, that's grossly inaccurate. Police estimate about 1,000 people attended that carnival. Officers called in extra resources from Maryland State Police and K-9 units, including a police helicopter to help disperse the crowd. You were there and watched everybody came there asked for their ID that you determined that those persons that was at the carnival are all Baltimore City residents. It's a bad statement to make. Now, Marquise Dent, who you heard from in that story, encourages Crandall to meet with those in Baltimore City to have a conversation. Now, I reached out to Crandall's office. I was told he is not giving interviews today. Reporting live in Dundalk, Karen Campbell, WBAL-TV 11 News.